Rebecca Adlington has announced she and her husband Dandy Parsons suffered a devastating miscarriage, which resulted in the Olympic swimmer needing emergency surgery. Rebecca then battled sepsis, which can be life-threatening, as well as a kidney infection and fever. The 33-year-old praised her husband for being her rock but added that they hadn't processed the tragedy just yet. In view of her 105k followers, Rebecca shared a photo of the cup of tea she was drinking from her hospital bed. Alongside it, she penned, on Tuesday me and Andy went to hospital for our 12-week scan only to discover we've had a miscarriage which resulted in emergency surgery. I managed to leave hospital Thursday only to be readmitted Friday. After a day of treating sepsis, a kidney infection and a fever I'm slowly on the mend. Long way to go but I'm in the right place. The double gold medalist continued, I can't thank the hospitals and the staff enough, been so supportive. It's such a devastating time but important in times like these we remember we aren't alone and have so much support. At Andrew Parsons 5 you have been my rock this week. Same with family and friends. We haven't managed to process it all yet but I know with their support we'll get through it. Once I'm able to leave hospital I'm extremely grateful I get to go home and give my two little ones the best hugs. She signed off. Fellow Olympic swimmer Adam Peaty, who recently announced his split from girlfriend Ari Monroe, rushed to show his support in the comments. Sending all my best, so sorry to hear it, he wrote. Ellie Simmons who is taking part in Strictly Come Dancing this year, added, sending love. Sports Orla wrote, I'm so terribly, terribly sorry. So many of us go through this and never talk about it. Dot your honesty will help so many people. Sending you so much love. Rebecca and Andy who announced they had tied the knot in September 2021 after meeting on dating app Bumble, share 18-month-old son Albie. The swimmer also has a daughter, 7-year-old Summer, with her ex-husband Harry Needs. She previously admitted to Hello! that she had been nervous to get back into dating after her divorce. Any kind of date is a big thing when you're not used to it, and I had never done online dating before, Becky revealed. I was wary, not just because of who I am but because I have a daughter as well, so I was very careful to check accounts were verified and linked to real social media accounts. I had only been using the app for a month and Andy was the first person I went on a date with, so I feel like I hit the jackpot," she added, 